Yeah, my uni home university is in Akita. It's a northern part of Japan, Tohoku region. And uh, yeah, it's actually a small city, even smaller than Riga. Yeah, but it's a nice city. Uh, in my home university, I'm studying a liberal arts. And uh, uh, here, I'm mainly studying the language, Latvian and Russian. And also, I'm studying a little about the culture of the Latvia and also the Baltic countries. It's almost the same. In my home university, also, the class was also in English, and the size of the classes are also the, almost the same. Yeah, it's not too big, too small, and it's very comfortable to study. Yeah. The biggest reason is that I wanted to study in Europe. I've never visited Europe before, and also I wanted to study the Russian. So, yeah, that is why I chose the Baltic countries. I actually arrived Riga in the end of the January, and that was the time the very cold winter, like the temperature was like a minus 15 degree or something. And, oh, it's very freezing. I don't think I can survive in this weather. Spring came, and yeah. <laughs> Usually, I'm. Yeah, visiting the museums in Riga and outside Riga. Yeah, compared to Japan, the museum is very cheap. I like the uh, old Riga. Yeah, there are a lot of old buildings and that cannot be seen in Japan. Yeah, also the atmosphere is very, you know, wonderful and uh, yeah, I like that place. I will go back to Japan next year. I don't have a concrete plan, but I think I want to use the what I learned in the university, mainly the Russian and Latvian. So maybe I might be working here. I might work as a uh, in a trade company and connect the Latvian in Japan, Russian in Japan, and so on. I already visited Estonia, Lithuania, Poland, and Germany. There are also the nice place, but the in my opinion, at, well, at least now, the Riga is the best place. Tagat Esjivoy Riga Latvia. This is my experience.